Hi, I'm, uh, I'm Mitch Cohen, uh, Flower City Arts Center. This is another installment of Say Yes to the Press. And what we're going to be talking about today is the often used but underappreciated coin. And there's the coin. It is a legitimate Scrabble word, Q-U-O-I-N. And it is really defined as a wedge. So early in the, the world of printing, um, they were using um, chases, uh, which is a rectangular frame to hold their forms, their type. And they used pieces of wood uh, that were wedged together. And, and I'm gonna be talking about the, 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 the short but effective evolution of the coin. So it started with wood shims um, that would hold the form in place. Um, and then it, uh, it sort of evolved into metal coins. Um, so there's a Papa Bear. We have Mama Bear. And we have a Baby Bear. Um, and they have their own key, their own little wrench that would fit there. And then as you, as you turn it, it expands. Fast forward. Um, and we have what is called speed lockups. Um, it also has its own key. And these extend, they basically do the same thing. Most printers tend to use the speed lockup. This is where the evolution pretty much ends. Except for some of the English versions. These are called Wickershams. Um, they're spring-loaded and they have their own um, way of, of expanding. So again, these, these, these items, these coins come in um, different shapes, different sizes, uh, but they effectively uh, do the same thing, which is to, which is to help in the, the lockup of, of your form. So as you can see here and here, that could easily be uh, two of these. Um, and uh, the little guys, um, these guys are usually used for um, smaller chases. Um, and that is the short uh, but effective uh, evolution of the coin.